Hello YouTube, this is Dragonheart and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today we have part 9 of my Carthage campaign on very hard difficulty and we have the Battle of Gadira. So, this is my army, Kartuba's finest. We have 11 men in the army. We're against 4 units from the fleet and we're against 3 in the garrison. So it should be a fairly straightforward battle, you would think. Um, I haven't got any more mercenaries I can get, but so we go straight ahead and we will assault them. I could auto resolve, but I want to show you guys a battle because in the last part we had a naval battle which was very quick and it was expected it was a it was an expected loss I should say. So I want to show you a proper battle. It's been a while since I've had a proper battle in this campaign. And yeah, that's basically it. So let's crack on with it. So the game is loading at the moment. The garrison in Gate Tuli is currently losing a lot of men, which is good for me. So we're not going to be against a uh, strong force. I have very basic units, as you can see. I have three units of skirmishers. I have six units of uh, basic militia spearmen. I also got my mercenary Iberian swordsmen. Mercenaries for Carthage do play a big role if you ever do a Carthage campaign. Like in this campaign, um, it's weird because I made a mistake in the last part where I didn't attack them and I clicked end turn, but it actually worked up in my favour because they didn't reinforce, they actually took men away. So, where are the men? Can I have a look on here? Uh, nothing over here, I believe. Nope, 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 nothing. Best way to attack would probably be straight through here. Could have flanked them over here. The ships are going to be on the beach anyway, so I could just go. Then again, I want, I'd like the ships to come to me, so we'll attack down straight down through here, I believe. Where's my line? Deployment line here. Oh, elephants. Just line these up. up uh, quickly as I can. I'm not going to worry about phalanx for now. Let's get the skirmishers in a formation. It's going to be very basic at the moment, very basic formation. Oh wait, I think all of this. i got to turn this guy off. I keep forgetting each time. For now I'm just going to bring this guy, these guys up. Bring these guys up. Bring the elephant. It's not really in a very organised formation. I'm just bringing them up to begin with. I'll work out formations once I get up here. I might attack one down this corridor and one down this corridor. Their ship's all the way over there, so I could take out perhaps their uh, their main infantry, which is going to be in the centre. Yeah, can't see them on the map at the moment. They're going to be in the, the central plaza, the the capture point. Only three units anyway. I may as well just run the buggers up, just run them all up. <laughs> you know what? I'm going to do it. Let's bring them all up. Fast forward this battle. Watch these bad boys go. Risky, could be risky. It could be risky, as Hannibal said. So where are they? Where are they? Where are they? Where are they? Nope, can't see them. Let's bring it to normal, normal speed. They run away or something. I don't know where they are. I'm going to take the capture point now if they're not there. Fast forward again. Oh, there they are. They're up there. So I can just go. Right, tell you what. I'll update there is you can go and take the capture point for me. Elephants. Go forward. What have we got? Tribesmen, tribesmen. Oh, you know what? I'm just going to charge them. Bugger it. We'll charge them and we'll put a unit cam this crap now. Right. Update ready. Right, Dennis, unit cam these bastards. Some more elephant action. Charge! Oh, that's beautiful. Oh my god. We are m raping them totally. Uh, let's do them out. Let's go for these guys next. We routed those bastards already. Charge into these guys. Oh my god, it's beautiful. Look at this. Someone make a mission out of this action. Oh my god, it's like bowling. Knocking the pins down. <laughs> She's just gone. <laughs> that was easy. Right, we'll bring these guys up now. Today, I got all these guys. I need to bring up a Brockus Street out by right here. My slingers can. Oh my God, it's glitching again. Bring these slingers up. Oh, I'm by there. I'll have one by there. I'll bring these guys up there. If I can, ah, I'll do. I don't care if it's not uh, looking thingy. It doesn't matter to me. Bring these guys up as well. My war elephants are just... I haven't lost an elephant, have I? Nope, I haven't lost an elephant. How many kills? I want to see the kills. 
99 kills. My bad. Yeah, this is why I like uh, Carthage. They're gener Where are they going? <laughs> Where did this is very hard difficulty. I know this isn't legendary, but it's very hard difficulty. I'm capturing your your province and you're running away like a bunch of idiots. Oh, they're coming back. Oh, wait, they, they, they're stealing my province. We must retake the province. Men of Getuli, the mighty Carthage have come to our shore, but we will take you back with three units of javelin men and one unit of noble infantry. Oh my god, I'm shivering. Right, we will take these guys out. The only way Balhamon knows. Take these guys out. I should put them on auto. Uh, auto uh, quick reload. Just charge them all in. I bring my infantry up a little bit. Let's get these the phalanx. I'm just gonna spam in to the window, to the wall. Javelin man. Bring these out a little bit. Where's my infantry by here? Oh, they're swordsmen. That's right. Doesn't matter. Uh, Hot potato's not being used. Just coming around there. My elephants are just sitting there, pleased with their day's work. Yeah, we're taking the capture point. It's too easy. The oh my god, look at this rubbish. I'm not even committing these two units. You know, do you know something? It is a bit frustrating when you're playing this game and and they just don't you know, attack. This is a general and he's just standing there watching his his city be taken by me. It's not very nice. 30 seconds and I'll have this province. And bring, just because of this guy I'm just gonna bring my war elephant and get to, Oh they've glitched on the boat. Oh, that's even worse. So what have we got? We got 160 of them waiting by here. And we got we've got one guy who just thought fuck it, I don't wanna get involved. Glitching on the boat. That's why they can't. I can't attack him. Look, I can't click. I can't click. I can bring him up though. I almost don't want to take the city just to. Can I continue battle after this? If I, I'm gonna continue battle, cause I want to just take his general out. He can't route, so I'm just gonna. Fuck it. I'm just gonna bring everyone up. I'm just gonna blob into this. Uh, <laughs> into this unit to see if I'll take him out. I'm not happy with that at all. I want to take a general out. Get the experience. Free experience. If it's on offer. Let's see. 160 of them. Oh, are they killing them? Are they? Or am I losing my own men? I'm losing my I'm losing my own men, shit. Oh, the war elephants will clear them out, surely. Yeah, I, I think so. And I put a war cry on. And I put stampede on. <laughs> 129, and just blobbing everything in. Yeah, yeah, just get them all in there, fuck it. <laughs> I can't believe I'm doing this. Oh my god, I'm just gonna blob them in, just to take one unit out, even though I've already won the battle. How are they down to? I've actually lost two units of war elephants doing this. How can I lose two el Oh, you know what? You know what's not worth it, this is, is a good battle, we won. I don't want to waste units. But yeah, basically, that was just too easy. I thought I'd have some sort of resistance, but you know this is very hard. And I've had episodes on my legendary Sparta campaign, and it's been the same way. So it's not the difficulty; it's just the way the AI is. And this is, you know, the latest patch. So yeah, they say they they say they're trying to improve CGI, but it's not really working. Desert nomadic zero percent. Uh, Occupy, it should be okay to Nova Cathargo held it before, so it should be okay to to hold it. Oh right, here we go. So we're taking Gadira. Uh, they have five units there. Oh my god, they got six there and three there plus seven. We don't need to five and six is eleven plus three. They are Replenish no, not replenishing, you know what I mean, they are injured, <laughs> that's the best first word I can think of, oh look at this over here, the old men of the desert, the wrinkly ninjas, right we need to take them out soon, I need to keep hold of car too, but I can actually, how many turns, I need to recruit tonight, so, do I get any like different units now I go to this province, no, what have I got, 
building is not available to my faction. I need a Hellenistic hamlet. I got at the moment to get a Hellenistic village. I lose food, but I get a better garrison, which would be beneficial. I could go for the public order because I can get mobs. I don't mobs though. Libyan hoplites. I get better re unit, recruit re yeah, unit recruitment. Unit morale upon recruitment, I should say. Could get that. I need to save my money though to keep rebuilding. I moved these in the last episode, so that's fine. I got a lot of money to spend. Can I recruit anything now? With you? I can, that's what I need to do. Oh, we got uh, some little rank ups here. What we got? Morale for elephants. <laughs> do I need more morale for my elephants? Maybe, maybe not. Uh, morale for all units would be beneficial. Armour for all units, that's a good one to have, so we'll get that. And what can we have? We can have ramming bonus. I don't like the fleet ones. Charge bonus for all units. Yeah, I'm gonna go for that. That's probably the best one. And I'm gonna recruit some more units here. So and I get three units here. And then I got five here. Oops. One, two, three, four. We get some units there as well. So in the next turn, I'll have 14 units in this army, plus my garrison, which is probably crap. Let's see. Oh, well, not too bad. Although four of them are mob, and they need to replenish as well. But it's nice to know that we got some garrison there. Um, I'm a bit worried about them attacking me, but I don't think they can this turn. They can get to Kadida, but they can't get to Katuba. Kadida's. I need to hold out really. It's my biggest problem at the moment. I could probably. What's it, Bossim got seven. Pl I could go for a Bossim with these uh, units. Although, yeah, I got a full stack navy. If I can just get by with what I've got, you know what? That's probably a good idea. If I can hit them on two fronts, maybe eventually take Carter Dash back. It is an honor to, serve. Honor to serve the mighty Carthage. Yeah, we're gonna go for a Bossim. I've only got 7 plus 2. I think but with what I've got with these three, I could probably take them out. We'll end turn. Ooh, what's this? E oh, edict, of course. Ooh, shit, right. Edict. What are you doing? Tax. Food would be beneficial, plus the public order. Wealth. Shipbuilding. Don't really need that at the moment. Mercenary. Uh, I've only got one unit of mercenary. One unit of mercenary unit, anyway. That didn't come out right, but you know what I mean. <laughs> Um, I think the food from the public order would be beneficial because I got minus 23 at the moment. I'm gonna end turn. See what happens in the end turn phase. Oh, my spy, of course, I forgot. So, yeah, um, for those of you that haven't watched the previous episode, part number 8, basically uh, in that episode I said, you know what? I'm fighting a losing battle in the Mediterranean. I'm gonna pull everything out. So, yeah, you might not see anything like this on YouTube with Carthage, but basically I've moved everything from Carthage from. Neapolis from Cosentia, whatever provinces I previously held in the Mediterranean, I've pulled out. And because basically I'm f I feel like I'm fighting a losing battle because. Oh shit. I can retreat, I will retreat. Because there's no point. Sometimes it's best not to give battle. Oh, they're gonna sh shit. Shit. I'm gonna auto resolve this. Because I can't win that. It's just pointless fighting that one. But yeah, basically, I thought there's no point in me actually trying to hold on to everything because I'm just reacting to everything rather than being proactive in the campaign. I think with Rome you need to be proactive with, 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 with all Total War games. See, like Carthage, I'm going to lose Carthage. I said I'd lose Carthage. There's no point holding on to this right here, so... All those siege... Oh, cause <laughs> See what I mean? How on earth would I have held that anyway? We have Libya with one unit of, uh, of the navy. I have a full... well, over half a stack of uh, Libya, um, of of Libya, I have a full stack from the Masaili, and I have half a stack of a navy from Syracuse. So I've got three factions fighting me at once. So I would never ever hold on to Carthage anyway. So this was really my probably my best option. If I'd stood and fought, I would have just been stretched thinly. My money would have been stretched thinly. My upkeep and my food would have all been stretched and. That's like the worst thing you can do. Of course, I could have uh, uh, raised my my taxes and stuff, but at the end of the day, is there really any point doing that? I actually can't take a boss in now anyway because 
all those different units are there. Desertion, capital loss. Corralis is now my my capital. I got nothing in Corralis. Oh, I'm actually building a public uh, order thing. But you see, look, the food's got up to plus four, and I got a fair bit of money to spend now as well. I was thinking of taking a boss in, but the gate tool is so close to me with this navy now that that would be suicidal as well. I could go for Carpet Dash itself. Uh, thinking about it, I could. This is a navy though, so I can't with that one, and this one. They're both navies. I I lost the only um, infantry that I had. I'm gonna take these off. Forced march. And I'm trying to think what's the best thing to do. I got probably better for me to keep them together. To the window. Now take the full fleet on double time up here because there's absolutely no point in oh there's a fleet by here we can't actually attack them it's a shame I could have taken them out shit anyway we go there uh, see we're going to have some resistance now 13 units but we luckily we recruited last turn that's good this ship I'm going to leave I want to try and diminish some of their movement points so I'm gonna actually cause them a nuisance by trying to blockade them. I'm gonna actually blockade a boss him. This is this is suicidal but I'm, I'm never gonna take it but I'm gonna maintain the blockade just to get them to think about that rather than chasing me down here. Might give me an extra turn to get there. See it's all planning ahead, all thinking. I do admit I think a lot more with my campaigns now. We're slowly building the Baytica's Legion over here, and we have Cartuba's Finest. Huzzah! Can any units from here? Oh, that doesn't work, does it? Because the whole army got to move just to move units around, which is stupid. In previous Total War games, I could just move one unit down here, another unit down here, but can't do that now, unfortunately. But yeah, we have a. This is what we got to try to take out now. 13 units. Oh, we know with the. Trying to think what's the best thing we could do. We need to upgrade this anyway, don't we? This gives me better growth. Yeah, we need this. We'll go for that this turn then. I could have recruited something else, but I'm going to attack them. I'm going to attack them. Oh, no, we're not going to attack them. Shit. Oh, bugger, this didn't work out very well, did it? They get all those reinforcing armies. Decline to attack. How have they got so many... Oh, because they... Oh, I see, look. This kind of... This radius actually helps them. I'm better off sitting there, then. I can't recruit bugger all, that's the problem. Can I actually re uh, raise another army? No, I can't. I've got no money, of course. <laughs> I might be down to one province after this now. I'm gonna s fly over here for a second. My spy is going over there. That's good. I still got. I'm surprised. I still got Cosentia to be honest. I've got nothing in Cosentia. I've just left it there for the dogs. Minus 56, minus 14 as well. <laughs> it's not worth it though, is it? I wish I could trade. I wish I could say, hey, I want to see spy here, have Cosentia, but like you could in previous games, Total War games, but you can't in this game. I suppose I could have started a new army in Corralis. Anyway, that's a, a different story for a different time. So yeah, we've made... Um, <coughs> oh, pardon me. We've made some province... Some province? Oh my god, I can't get my words out again. We've made some progress in this campaign. We've taken Gadira. I'm expecting a backlash in the next episode, but I will be ready for it, I think. I hope you've enjoyed. I've been Dragonheart. Until next time, goodbye.